These two cases considered the issue of capacity, and it was the first time the court was required to consider the power under the Succession Act, which confers a power to the court to authorise the registrar to make, alter or revoke a will on behalf of a person who lacks testamentary capacity. A will made in accordance with these provisions is called a statutory will. In this case, a man made a will ten years before an accident resulted in his incapacity being brought into question. His older brother applied for a statutory will to be drawn up to avoid the possibility of intestacy, or indeed to go to the Crown. The Minister for Community Services also applied for a statutory will for a child who was awarded a victim's compensation amount at the age of four months due to an injury from his parents in order to avoid the child's estate going to his parents on intestacy. The court distinguished these two situations as lost capacity and nil capacity situations. The elderly man had lost his testamentary capacity and indeed the child never possessed testamentary capacity. The court was there.